Summary of Risk Management Introduction Managing risks is super important in projects. It means figuring out what could go wrong, checking how bad it could be, and then making plans to deal with it, all to make sure the project stays on track. 1. Risk Management Identify, assess, and respond to project risks to minimize their impact on project goals. 2. Risk Ratings Assess risks on a scale of low, medium, or high based on their potential impact on project objectives. 3. Post-project meetings. Hold internal post-project meetings within the organization and an evaluation meeting with the customer or sponsor. 4. Open-ended question meetings. Discuss potential additional projects and seek permission to use the customer as a reference. 5. Lessons learned. Gather insights from project experiences to improve bidding, planning, and executing future projects. 6. Closing a project. Finalize payments, document lessons learned, and evaluate staff performance. 7. Communication. Utilize personal verbal communication, considering body language and tone, as well as international and cultural communication norms. 8. Project status meetings. Regularly scheduled meetings to inform stakeholders, address problems, and assign action items. 9. Project team meetings. Before scheduling, assess the necessity, purpose, participants, distribute agendas, and prepare visual aids. 10. Meeting notes. Publish meeting results within 24 hours to ensure everyone is informed and accountable. Conclusion. So, to wrap up, Handling risks well is key to making projects work. By checking risks, having meetings after the project, learning from mistakes, and talking clearly, project managers can keep things running smoothly and finish the project strong.